Hello, this is John here from heywordpress.com. You know, nowadays creating a website is easy. We can create anything just by drag and drop. Just have a look on this beautiful website section. Isn't that cool? You can use it inside of your portfolio website to make it really stand out. Or you can use this concept to create any other thing with your own creativity. And we can create that very easily using Elementor Page Builder. If you don't have Elementor, I will put the link in the description. You can download it from there and it's completely free. I will show you how easily you can create this about area, nice progress bar and this nice countdown timer where you can showcase your all work report. Hey, if you are excited, don't forget to like this video and subscribe this YouTube channel. Now let's do it. So now we are inside Elementor Page Builder. Here we can see a nice banner and under that here we can see a nice service section. Now in between these two sections I want to create that about me section. So let's first click on this plus icon. Now I want to take a new section. So to do that let's click on this plus icon. Now I want to select the single column structure. So let's click here. Now this is our new section. Now I want to add some padding at the top and bottom. So let's go to the advanced tab. Click here. Now unbind the padding. Let's add 100 pixel padding at the top and 100 pixel padding at the bottom. Alright. Now I want to add a background color. So let's go to style. From here background type. Select the color. Let's take a whitish color. Okay. Click outside. Now I want to add a heading. Now let's go to the elements. Drag a heading widget inside the column. Now change the text. I'm typing about me. Now let's change the color. Go to the style. Text color. I wanna make it black. Typography. Font family. Ruby. Font size. Default is fine. Font weight default. Line height 1. And letter spacing 1 is fine. Now under this heading I want to take an inner section. So let's go to element, click on Rubik's Cube icon and drag this inner section under the heading. Now here you can see the two columns but I want to make it three. So to do it just right click on this column icon and click on duplicate. Ok. On the left column I want to insert my image and then on the mid column I want to add some text and on the right column I want to put some progress bar. Ok. So first let's click on the left column icon. I want to reduce its width. So from left here you can see column width. Let's make it 20%. Ok. Now inside this column I want to add an image. So let's click on this plus icon. Drag an image. Let's select an image. Choose image. And this is my image. Insert media. Ok. Image size. Thumbnail size. Alignment center. Now I want to make this image rounded. So to do it let's go to style. Now here border radius. First let's make it percent and give it 50% border radius. See it becomes rounded. Now let's go to the next column. Click on this plus icon. Drag a text widget. I wanna change this text from here. Now I wanna change some style. So click this pencil icon. Go to the style tab. Text color. Make it the blackish color. Click here and go to the typography. Font family. Rubik. Font size 14 pixel. Font weight. Default is fine. Text transport default. Line height default is fine. And letter spacing on. It looks great. Now I want to add a button under the text. So let's go to the elements and drag a button under the text. Now I want to do some style with this button. Let's change the button text. So from left instead of click here I'm typing download CV. Now inside the link you can put your CV zip link or PDF link. Make the alignment left. Let's go to the style. Click on typography. Family Rubik. 
আচ্ছা ফন্ট সাইজ সিক্সটিন পিক্সেল ফন্ট ওয়েট সিক্স হান্ড্রেড রেস্ট ইস ফাইন আই জাস্ট ওয়ানা অ্যাট সাম লেটার স্পেসিং লেটস মেক ইট থু ও সাম নাও ক্লিক আউটসাইড নাও ক্লিক অন ব্যাকগ্রাউন্ড কালার লেটস মেক ইট ব্ল্যাক ইস অ্যান্ড অ্যাট সাম বর্ডার রেডিয়াস লেটস অ্যাট টোয়েন্টি ফাইভ ইট লুকস গুড নাও আই ওয়ান অ্যাট সাম প্যাডিং সো লেটস আনবাইন্ড দ্য প্যাডিং অন টপ টুয়েলভ পিক্সেল রাইট থার্টি ফাইভ পিক্সেল বটম টুয়েলভ পিক্সেল অ্যান্ড লেফট থার্টি ফাইভ পিক্সেল খুল নাও আই ওয়ান অ্যাট সাম হোভার ইফেক্ট সো লেটস ক্লিক অন হোভার and hover background color i wanna select the greenish one now let's have a look if we hover over on it you see the color is changing also i wanna add hover animation so from here click on it and select shrink okay it looks perfect now have a look you see this image is not vertically aligned so to make it align click on this column icon here you can see vertical align let's make it middle okay now another thing i want to make the middle column with 240 percent so from left column with 40 percent now let's move to the right column here i want to add some progress bar some nice looking progress bar click on this plus icon from the left i'm searching for progress bar here it is let's now drag it to the right column this is the default look but i want to design it and make it really cool i want to replace the text my skill to do that from left let's replace the text you can control the percentage by dragging it to the left or right like this okay let's keep it 85 and i don't wanna display the percentage so let's hide it click here make it hide i wanna remove the inner text let's do some styling so go under style tab make the color to a red color and the background color let's keep it black but i wanna make it transparent so drag the bar on left okay now let's make the height 10. to 10 and border radius 25 pixel or keep it 20. now change the title text color so click on title style the text color i wanna add black color and typography font family rubik font size 14 pixel font weight 600 make the transform uppercase line height 1 and letter spacing 1 perfect now i wanna duplicate this progress bar couple more time so right click on this pencil icon and duplicate do this one more time and one more time all right now i wanna change all this text and the different colors also different percentage so i'm doing it really quick and coming back to you so i have changed all those now i feel like we need some space at the top and bottom now click on the six dot that means the inner section is selected now go to the advanced tab i wanna add 50 pixel margin at the top and 50 pixel margin at the bottom it looks decent now so now under this inner section i wanna add a nice countdown timer with nice icons so let's take another image section go to elements drag an inner section here here we can see two columns now on the left column first i wanna add an icon so let's click on this plus icon drag an icon and under the icon i wanna insert a nice counter with animation so go to the elements i'm searching for counter here it is let's drag this under the icon okay let's do some style first i wanna change this icon so click over from left click on the icon i'm searching for check icon this one now click on insert now go to style make the size 100 and change the color 
click on the color picker select a off white color let's make it black first now reduce the transparency let's keep it like this all right click outside now click on this counter and from the left you can change the starting number the ending number so i wanna make the ending number maybe 300 change title let's go to the style click on it change the text color to black now typography font family rubik font size 36 weight 900 transform uppercase and line height keep it 0.7 awesome now i wanna duplicate it couple more time so right click on this column icon and duplicate duplicate once more time duplicate right click here click on delete it's gone now i wanna change all these icons the numbers and the text really quickly so i'm doing it really fast and coming back to you okay i have changed everything now have a look this about me section looks really great and unique okay and don't forget to click this update button to save your work now the last thing i wanna check it how it's looking on mobile device and tablet device so to check it let's go to the responsive mode first go to tablet top section look good but here the icons looks a bit bigger so only on tablet i wanna make the icons a bit smaller so click on the pencil icon go to style here you can see the tablet icon that means if you change anything here that will only effect on tablet device your desktop view will remain same so we are basically changing it for tablet device only let's make it 80 for tablet it looks great now i wanna do the same for all the icons and here is the easy way just right click on this pencil icon click on copy now click on this pencil icon don't click on this paste but click on the paste style okay do the same with this one also with this one all right now let's have a look on mobile so go to the mobile device and click on mobile this section looks great now scroll down this area looks great now scroll down and these icons these counters everything looks great on mobile device awesome so in this way you can create any section using this awesome page builder here no code is involved only just by clicking and some drag and drop you are able to create kind of amazing looking section that's incredible if you wanna make a complete website from start to finish everything step by step then we have a complete tutorial for that I will put the tutorial link in the description. You can check that out. Thanks for watching and if you like it, please like this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel if you wanna watch the similar type of valuable step-by-step -step tutorial videos. For now, bye-bye.